morning, good afternoon, good night, whenever you're watching this. I'm sorry for my appearance, but this is a last minute project. So it is Sunday, August 30th, and I'm out of breath because I just walked up the stairs. So obviously two days left in the month, and I have this stupid goal that in the next 48 hours I'm gonna try to finish two books. Technically one is a novella, but still. Um, I'm sorry I'm shiny, I washed my face and put on my sunscreen, so this is what I look like in the house. I'm always shocked when people do vlogs because they always look presentable, and I do not. So this is the best you get. Okay, so my goal is to read the third Murderbot novella. I'll put a picture here because I can't remember what it's called. And then to finish Take a Hint, Danny Brown, which I'm technically only 40 pages into. So again, it's a bit of an absurd goal, but I'm gonna try. So I am taking today and tomorrow off of the gym, although I do have an appointment tomorrow. And these are my least busy days, even though I do have laundry to do and I'm gonna clean my floors. So hopefully I can do that. I'm gonna try to vlog these two days and see if, um, basically like my sprint to the end of the month to see if I can get these books finished. So wish me luck. Anyway, I've already started laundry. It's 8.54 on Sunday morning and then I'll have breakfast, then I'll do the floors and then I'm gonna read, hopefully. Okay, I'm gonna try, bye. Damn, a bitch hate to be ashy. I know you live your life like that, but. This is why I don't, this is why I don't vlog. I ain't good at it. Distressed, they are in distress. <laughs> That's with them <laughs> damn hands, yeah. Okay, so I'm 27% in this book. I started Rogue Protocol. It's the third murder bot novella by Martha Wells. Yes. So, I mean, I'm only 27%, but it's off to a little slower start than the first two. I've heard that some people, like the third one, isn't their favorite, so we shall see. But I think it's finally getting past the setup part, and some things are start are hopefully going to start popping off soon. But I am hoping that in the next. Well, Nigel needs to eat in like 15 minutes and then we'll go outside and all that. So maybe in the next couple hours I can finish it and then start on Take a Hint Danny Brown because I need to start that today if I'm going to be able to finish it by tomorrow. But as you can see, I am working on laundry. I did my floors earlier. I didn't film that and I'm going to go back to reading. So there's my update. Really get 
getting some good looks in this breeding vlog. So I just finished Rogue Protocol by Mark Wells and I gave it three stars. Definitely wasn't as good as the first two. This one took a while to like pick up. I mean, it is a novella, but it really didn't start picking up to 35, 40%. And then there was a lot of action and it was good and it ended quickly or it ended like they all do. But yeah, three stars. It still was really good. Just not as good as the first two. So I accomplished the novella that I wanted to read. Now I need to pick up Take a Hint, Danny Brown, but I do need a snack. It is, I don't know what time it is, three something. And probably need to go change out a load of laundry and fold those, make myself a snack, and then I can start taking a hint, Danny Brown, hopefully. Sometimes I get distracted and I go on Instagram or go on Twitter and then an hour later I haven't read, but I am trying to focus on my goals, so wish me luck. Hi, good morning. It is really bright outside. I'm shiny, I just put on sunscreen, very important. Um, it is 9.22, I've got an appointment at 10. I'm outside with where is he? This one before I leave. And so it's Monday, August 31st. I finished Rogue Protocol yesterday. I feel like my neighbors are staring at me, but well, well. I started or I continued Get a Life, Danny, Get a Clue, Take a Hint, Take a Hint, Danny Brown. I got to like page 100 yesterday, so I've got 200 pages left today. I also need to film a video today, so wish me luck. Okay, this one just ran up the stairs. I forgot to close the gate, so I had to come get him. Say hi! Oh, he's getting heavy. So I just filmed and finished filming my video, and I've got myself really angry. I wanted to put him down for a second. Got myself really angry. If you've watched that video, then you know why. So I need to calm down, and I'm gonna go read. Hey, hey! I'm gonna go read, take a hint, Danny Brown, and calm down. It'll be lunchtime for me and Nigel. So there's my update. I really hope I can finish, but I do need to edit my video today and put it up so I can do closed captioning. If not today, tomorrow morning, because I need to post it tomorrow, which is Tuesday. So wish me luck. So I just finished eating lunch, which you saw. I'm like 150 pages into Take a Hint, Danny Brown, and I'm about to go back to reading. So I like, I like it. Not as much as I was loving Get Alive, Chloe Brown. And I don't know if I love Chloe so much and Red. I like Danny. I don't connect to Zaf that much, but I don't know, maybe it's because Get a Life Chloe Brown was more like enemies to lovers. Not even enemies, really just like uh, to love. I don't know how to kind of. They kind of seem like enemies to lovers. Kind of. <clears throat> but this one's like fake dating. And I don't know if I love the fake dating trope because I don't know. Like they already like each other. It's just kind of waiting for the will they won't they. But Zaf seems like a nice guy, you know, he's very, he listens to romance books and he believes in the happily ever after, which is weird, but okay. Excuse me. So I'm liking it. I'm not loving it, but uh, I've got at least 150 pages more to go, so I need to get cracking. I don't even know where I'm looking at, the, at this point. I just refilmed my video because I got so mad in it earlier that I had to refilm it and try to be more calm. I, yeah, I was falling asleep reading Take a Hint, Danny Brown, but I think that's more on that I have pasta for lunch and less that I'm bored with the book. But I re-recorded that. I think I'm going to read a little bit more and then I'm going to edit my video. It's not looking promising that I'm going to finish today, but I'm really going to try. So I'm probably not going to finish that book today. It's 7.16. We're about to go on a run. We're real pumped for it. Uh, so I still have like a hundred and something pages left in Take a Hint, Danny Brown, and I'm in the middle of editing my video that needs to go up tomorrow. So that's priority. I'm going to try. I don't think I'll finish it, but we'll see. I'll let you know. There's Mount Etna. I just finished my mile. I got nine minutes, 14 seconds, which every is a record for me, a record for me. My last mile was nine minutes, 19 seconds. I'm trying to get better every day. 
and I got a long walk home to cool down. Yeah, I really don't think I'm gonna finish that book tonight, but whew, editing just takes so damn long. Anyway, I'm gonna stop hard breathing and panting in your ear. Boost. If it's echoey, I'm in the bathroom, but I just finished my run and I shouldn't have touched my face. But I'm gonna wash my hands and then I'm gonna do my nighttime skincare routine. I'm no skincare guru, so, you know. I have combination skin, if you're curious. My T-zone is very oily, but the rest of my visc is really dry, especially right here. But, um, so I didn't have any makeup on today, but I've been putting on sunscreen all day, so I still double cleanse every night. Oh, that's right. When I have makeup on, which is rare, I like to use this cleanser, which is, the that I met you cleansing balm. I really like to use that, but my phone is propped up against it right now. <laughs> but it's expensive to me. So when I don't have makeup on, I just use this Pons cold cream makeup remover that basically just any oil based cleaner. Should you be taking a shower? Don't worry about that, okay? Salicylic acid, so I don't use it twice a day. I can never get more of my hairline. this toner but that's all I have to my stuff comes from Paula's Choice like I said hey, I'm a bear. hey hi hey hi okay bye wash my hands nighttime Neutrogena Hydro Boost what do the kids say it slaps do the kids still say that no. well what do they say if something's the bomb. They don't say it's lit anymore. Slaps came after lit. Slaps been before lit. Who? Ain't nobody say that. I thought you had your finger on the pulse of the urban community. Your pulse is off. Untrustworthy. Anyway, slaps, lit, whatever. I love this stuff. Now, every other night almost, I exfoliate with Paula's Choice B B H A. But I did it last night, so I'm not gonna do it tonight. So I'm gonna finish off with the CeraVe healing ointment, so I can be part of the Glaze Donut Gang. If you don't know. Only thing I don't like about this tube, I wish I had the jar, was it's so thick that it takes a bit squeeze to get out. I just take the thing off. I love it. It's so good. I do put on a lip mask, but I don't do that till right before I go to sleep. All done. Okay. It is. 11.55, I did not finish Take a Hint, Danny Brown. I didn't even read again since the last time I updated you. I literally finished editing my video maybe 30 minutes ago 
and now I'm gonna put on this lip mask and I'm gonna go to bed so I failed in my 48 hour reading challenge but I got some progress at vlogging hopefully this isn't too terrible anyway um, this is gonna be the end of the vlog it's always cold in my house so I hope you can thumbs up if you like the video subscribe comment down below and tell me your favorite like midnight snack I just had a three musketeers it was so good but thanks for watching bye Abs be hurting. I don't even be doing abs. I probably should, but I mean, I don't be doing them directly. I guess I'd be doing it indirectly. Damn, you burnt that whole stack of cookie already? <gasps> Boozy. Boozy, what time is it? So good. I'm gonna give you some good cool water here. Just right now, you would try to eat my cookies and get my coffee. Let's be your health and safety.